how maths is our future in space exploration. Let's imagine that you're living in the distant future with our spacecraft flying to other planets such as Mars. How are some of the ways that maths will be used to safely take you across space? In this day, the spacecraft would be in a factory under construction. Math will be used here to calculate the mass and top speed of the rocket. To reach space, this spacecraft will need to travel at a minimum of 11.2 km per second. Math will also be used in calculating the cost of this project. Maths will be required to calculate how much load the spacecraft can carry and how to recycle most effectively. In the ISS, there are already ways water and oxygen are reused, so the future spacecraft could improve on these technologies to become more efficient. Space is full of obstacles that could destroy the spacecraft. To avoid this debris and incredible speeds, math will need to be used to map out the route to Mars and calculate the time this would take. This will be very important in the future, as in space all the planets are constantly moving, so we need to use math in order to calculate where this planet would end up by the time we reach it. Math will need to be used to make sure that the thickness of the spacecraft blocks out space radiation. A problem we will encounter is that zero gravity has detrimental effects to the human body. Math will need to be used to calculate how long the body is safe, and future spacecraft could even use centrifugal force to prevent these dangerous effects. As we reach our destination, maths will need to be used to calculate when the spacecraft should stop accelerating to land on Mars. In the future, when spacecraft have the ability to reach Mars, they will need to use the gravity of Mars itself to safely slow down. Now, on Mars, there are many ways maths will need to be used to live on the new home. We must use maths to determine the gravity on the new home, its temperature and also wind speeds. For maintaining human life for generations, it is crucial that we found out ways to reduce food, energy, create oxygen and protect ourselves from harmful space radiation. Using today's technology, it would take 3 to 22 minutes to communicate with Mars, depending on its position in its orbit. The current fastest unmanned spacecraft from NASA's New Horizon mission took 39 days to reach Mars, so in the future, maths will also be used to create faster rockets. One futuristic communication method is warp drive, which uses math to bend space and time in order to travel faster than the speed of light. With this new technology, space exploration to Mars would take a matter of minutes, and communication would prove to be much easier. Congratulations, you have now made it to Mars. Overall, maths will allow us to build the spacecraft. Maths will take us on the journey to other planets. Maths will also help us live on these other planets. And then maths will connect the new planet with Earth. Maths is our future.